Hey guys, welcome back to BJ Tech News, episode 58. And okay, uh, another Ubuntu video. Um, again, this is mostly about applets. Uh, there's a lot of applets in, um, in Ubuntu that you can install. I'm just installing the ones I think it's cool. Uh, I installed the weather applet, uh, the system load applet, and the classic menu. Today's episode, I'm going to show you guys how to install the hardware sensor. Now the hardware sensor indicator shows you information from your system hardware uh, sensors such as your temperature of your systems, hardware, speed of the fans, and also the temperature of your computer and all that good stuff. Because I'm running this on a virtual machine, most likely my sensors won't work, but if you guys are running this on a laptop and um, you install the drivers for Ubuntu to talk to your laptop properly, the sensors will work properly. So, uh, like always, I'm going to start a terminal service up. Okay. First command I want to do is a sudo apt. I mean, add app uh, repository. Spell repository right. I want to get that wrong. PPA Alex Murray. Force flash indicator sensors. Hit enter. Provide your credentials. Hit enter. Hit enter again. It's going to treat, retrieve everything you need to do. Do a sudo app get update. Hit enter. And the last command you want to do is sudo app get install indicator and sensors hopefully that works okay looks like it worked let's see if I go to my dash home and I search hardware hardware sensor there you go and again Go to your preferences, that's it about. Go to preferences and you can start automatically. Again, I'm, a, I'm in a virtual machine, so I really don't have any sensors on this virtual machine. But most likely, if you guys do have a physical machine, you install Ubuntu, you try this applet out. Hey, leave a comment below. Leave a comment below and let me know how that works out. Uh, I haven't really tested out, I haven't really found a physical machine in the house to actually install Ubuntu and test this applet out. But hey, I show you the three commands that you need to do to get this stuff up and running. Hey, try it out. Leave a comment below as well as subscribe to get the latest and greatest tips and reviews on hardware and software. And also, please subscribe. Guys, thank you so much. And I appreciate all the support. And I catch you guys later. Thank you. Subscribe. Thank you.